Hi everybody! I am back for another video of Holy Grail products and this one I'm so excited about because it's my favorite skincare and body care products and they're all natural. I'm really excited to share them with you so let's go ahead and get started. I want to start with skincare which pretty much to me it means like anything that I put on my face. So the very first one is the Burt's Bees Radiance Facial Cleanser with Royal Jelly and it just sprayed me a little bit. Um, I think I might have mentioned in a video that I wanted to try something else and I wouldn't be repurchasing this. This is actually, you know, kind of empty now. But I did purchase like a new cleanser from Yes2. I think it was Yes to Cucumbers and that has alcohol in it and I didn't like it. So I kind of wish I just bought a new one of these. But you know, I'm going to keep using it. But once I'm done with that, I'm going to repurchase this because first of all, it smells amazing. If you, you know, didn't know that already, if you haven't <laughs> watched my other videos about it. But oh my gosh, it's just nice. And it makes my face feel awesome. So yeah. Radiance really 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 works. The next skincare product is my day moisturizer and I have a different night moisturizer but I don't know if that's kind of holy grail just yet because I want to try other products out there but I wanted to mention my day moisturizer because this is my second um is this a jar? I'm not really sure. But I'm talking about the Indeed Labs Hydroluron Moisture Jelly. First of all, I am absolutely in love with the packaging of this. I mean, it's ridiculous. Like you can get the very last drop and then even after the last drop, you can open it and squeeze some more. <laughs> so I'm just so happy with this product and I would highly, highly, highly recommend it to anybody. It's so light and you know, amazing to go under makeup. I don't know what else I can say, but oh my gosh, I am in love with this. The next two products are face masks, and if you know me, I'm pretty lazy about, you know, pampering and all of that, but when I am in the mood to pamper, I use the Pacifica face mask. I have the hydration mask and the resurfacing mask, which is basically an exfoliating mask, I believe. It says somewhere in here. It says it exfoliates, so, Oh my gosh, I am in love with these two because seriously, like right now, um, you probably can't tell, I'm not going to zoom in just so you can see, but I have some dryness around my chin yet again and after I film this video, I'm going to use these two as like some kind of treatment. So this one I think 5 to 20 minutes and this one I think I'm just going to leave on overnight because I really, really need some hydration, especially in that area. So I'm really excited to use this again. So yeah, I mean, if you're looking for masks, I really, really would recommend these. And they're kind of cool. So the next products that I'm going to be talking about are body care. The first product that I want to talk about is the product that I just, you know, can't stop raving on and on about. The product that I can't stop talking about is my Alba Botanica body cream. I got a text message. Sorry about that. Um, oh my goodness. You, seriously, I look at this and I think of love. I think of that moment when you see something you love and then you get that you know, like the, the hearts in your eyes. <laughs> what is this video? Oh, anyways, this is a brand new one. I, I already used it once. I just lifted this little thing and used it on my arms today, actually. Oh my goodness. It smells so good. It's not even strong either. Um, some people think it is, but I'm like, seriously? When I say some people, I mean one person. <laughs> um, it really is not strong. It's so subtle and I don't like wearing perfume so I like these because you know it gives off a little bit of nice scent to it but it's not overpowering. It's not like obnoxiously in your face. I'm like oh my gosh I'm wearing perfume. I mean really what are you trying to hide? <laughs> okay the next product that I want to talk about 
is a holy grail sunscreen and this is the Aloe Botanica Very Emollient Pure Lavender Sunscreen with SPF 45. I love this. Um, I'm very bad at using sunscreen but when I actually do remember it, this is the one I go for. When I use this, I usually just skip um, like in any buddy butters like this one um, because I feel like, you know, I have the moisture I need from this plus SPF. But I wouldn't use it as a moisturizer. Nope. Anyways, <laughs> um, you might notice a pattern that all of my favorite body products are from Alba Botanica. So this one is again from Alba Botanica and this is the shave cream that I have. It's the unscented one. Obviously it's all natural and it's, it's great for anything. It has the consistency of like a really thick um, conditioner. And I love that. So, yeah, I mean, I wouldn't mind a lavender scented shave cream, but I don't mind this either. It's for sensitive skin, it's hypoallergenic, and it's extra conditioning. So, that is such a big plus because I don't like it when, you know, you're shaving and then maybe a day later or something, you start like, you start feeling like, oh my gosh, my skin is dry. Why? So, I would highly recommend this one. The very last Holy Grail body product that I have is another Alba Botanica product, obviously, and another lavender product, obviously, and this is my shower gel. I sound really annoying right now. Um, but anyways, this shower gel is so amazing. Um, yeah, this is, I mean, it's huge. 32 fluid ounces. I don't know if you can tell how big this thing is, but I think I can use it for another month or so. It's ridiculous, but I am so happy that I bought this. This and this is actually about the same price, if not the exact same price, but I go through this obviously a little more quickly. I go through this about maybe a month and a half if I use it every day, so I'm trying not to. Um, but this one, I've had it for like months and months and months and it's still going. Um, it's also moisturizing. It doesn't have SLS, so it, obviously it's not going to dry out your skin and, you know, kind of require you to use buddy butter or lotion or whatever kind of moisturizer you need to put in your body. Um, but yeah, and it's cruelty free. Um, I, you know, I've never really paid attention to products that's cruelty free, but Alba Botanica is completely cruelty free, you know, if you wanted to know that. But yeah, I would highly, highly, highly recommend this. Um, this is the only shower gel I'll ever buy until I find something better, which I doubt. So, yeah. And the packaging is amazing. Anyways, I'm gonna stop rambling on and on and on because... I don't even know what this video came to because <laughs> I think I'm just tired or hungry or both. That's what happens. I didn't drink anything. That's probably another problem. I need to drink some water. Anyway, <laughs> if you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up. Um, I wouldn't blame you if you don't give this video a thumbs up, honestly. Oh gosh. I'll see you next week. Bye. They're not that expensive and they're amazing on your skin. I probably shouldn't have done that to the clean ones.